very important. It's been a, a very big challenge and is a very big challenge uh, for us. More than, uh, I would say, difference between country, I would say difference between culture. Elite in culture, you establish uh, uh, leadership requires and is based on trust among people. It's very difficult to have leadership by rules and, and by, uh, let's say, abstract concept. Uh, people need to know, uh, and you see this, people choose people and uh, on the basis of personal knowledge and trust. In an Anglo-Saxon culture, you can uh, have uh, a much more institutional approach to leadership. Uh, rules are very important. Um, you can build much larger structure and more organized, established institution on a much larger scale. But it's difficult to complement the two uh, culture. Our company is born as a Latin company, Italian origin, Argentinian, Mexican, uh, Latin American, and then expanded everywhere. But the big clash is with Anglo-Saxon uh, culture. Anglo-Saxon culture has a, um, a more mobility, less stability on the job, uh, less sense of long-term and uh, long-term commitment, but a much more uh, respectful approach to rules. Uh, you can have a manager choosing person on the basis of a curriculum, on uh, the basis of his uh, achievement, without knowing him. In Latin culture, your manager, before choosing anybody, will need to establish a trust relation to understand that they could uh, build on trust. Now, these two cultures are very difficult to complement. This is the big challenge of Tenaris, and today even bigger. With the new investment in, uh, in North America, the American operation is uh, American, Canadian, the Anglo-Saxon operation are uh, becoming larger and larger. But the clash of culture is strong, and we need to continuously work on this, as is always. Uh, understanding the other, and complementing each other instead of clashing in the concept, no?